alaikum. Uh, our lecture today is the bony pelvis, ligaments, muscles, and the pelvic floor. The bony pelvis, uh, a bony ring composed of paired innominate bones, the sacrum, and the coccyx. The innominate bones articulate with each other anteriorly and with the sacrum posteriorly. Each innominate bone is composed of three parts, which is fused at the estabulum, which, is, which are the ilium, ischium, and pubis. This is the anterior and posterior view of the bones that consist the bony pelvis. Uh, and this is the innominate bone, which consists of the ilium, ischium, and pubic bone. The ilium is a flat curved bone uh, and bears the iliac crest superiorly. The anterior and posterior superior iliac spines are on either end of the iliac crest, with the anterior and posterior inferior iliac spines below them. The inner surface of the bone is smooth and has a sharp crest at its base, the arcuate line, running from the sacroiliac joint to the iliopectineal eminence. arcuate line. This line extends anteriorly to the pubic tubercle as the anatomic iliopectineal line. The pubic bone consists of the body, inferior and superior rami, articulate with its fellow at the symphysis pubis. The pubic bone is strengthened on all sides by dense ligaments. The ischium is composed of a body and an inferior ramus. The body bears a tuberosity inferiorly and the spine posteriorly. This is the spine and the, the spine and the tuberosity. The ischial spine defines the greater and lesser sciatic notches above and below. The sacrum. The sacrum uh, consists by five fused vertebrae comprised this triangular bone, which is curved posteriorly. The anterior part of its upper end is termed the sacral promontory. It articulates with the lumbar spine superiorly and with the coccyx inferiorly. Anteriorly, the sacrum has four pairs of sacral foramina, which transmit nerves from the sacral canal. The sacrum also bears four pairs of posterior sacral foramina, and the canal ends posteriorly in the sacral hiatus, which is a midline opening that transmits the fifth sacral nerve. This is the sacrum anteriorly and posteriorly, and uh, you can see the four sacral foramina. And this is the sacral hiatus. The coccyx is composed of three to five fused vertebrae. The first segment is often separate. It articulates at an acute angle with the sacrum. Uh, now uh, we have the ossification center of the innominate bone. We have three primary centers, one for the ilium, appear at second month of intrauterine life, and one for the ischium at third month, and one for the pubis at fourth month. And we have the secondary centers, two for iliac crest, two for Y-shaped triradiate cartilage of estabulum, and one for ischial tuberosity. The ilium, ischium, and pubis all fuse at seven to nine years. Estabulum fusion, uh, which means the replacement of triradiate cartilage, occur at 20 to 25 years. And this is uh, a juvenile innominate bone to the right. Uh, we can see the ilium, ischium, and pubis. And on this X-ray, we see the development: one year, two year, and nine years, and thirteen years. We can see the development of the innominate bone and the pelvic ring bones. The sacroiliac joints are covered with cartilage and lined with synovium. The joint surface is flat and uneven, and this irregularity helps look the sacrum into the iliac bones. Ligaments support the front and back of the joint. Uh, there are dense introsseous sacroiliac ligaments, which further look the sacrum to the iliac bones, limiting movement in all planes. We have three important uh, ligaments. The first one is the sacrospinous ligament, runs from the ischial spine <clears throat> to the sides of the sacrum and the uh, coccyx. It defines the inferior limit of the greater sciatic foramen. And the sacrotuberous ligaments run from the ischial tuberosity to the sides of the sacrum and coccyx. It defines the posterior limit of the tessar sciatic foramen. And uh, finally, the iliolumbar ligament runs from the transverse process of L5 
the posterior part to the posterior part of the iliacus, further stabilizing the joint. In this picture, we can see the sacro and uh, sacroiliac ligament, sacrotuberous ligament, and sacrospinous ligament. And this is the ilio lumbar ligament. And from posterior, this is the sacroiliac ligament, and this is the ilio lumbar ligament. And the sacrospinous and sacrotuberous. The pelvic muscles at the level of the iliac crest, the paired serous muscles lie on either side of the spine. They descend anteriorly, fusing with the iliacus muscle, which arrives from the inner surface of the ilium. The fused iliosaurus muscle passes anteriorly under the inguinal ligament to insert into the lesser trochanter of the femur. The piriformis muscle <clears throat> passes obliquely from the anterior aspect of the sacrum, exiting the pelvis through the greater sciatic foramen behind the estabulum to insert into the greater trochanter of the femur. Uh, here we can see the iliacus and the sous muscle and the common tendon, which pass behind the inguinal ligament to the lesser trochanter of the femur. Uh, the obturator membrane closes the obturator foramen. The obturator internus muscle arrives from the inner surface of the membrane as well as the bony rim of the obturator foramen. Its fiber converge with the lesser sciatic foramen as it hooks around the posterior part of the ischia between its tuberosity and spine. It passes through the lesser sciatic foramen to insert into the greater trochanter of the femur. The aponeurosis of the abdominal wall muscles inserts into the superior surface of the pubic bone. A thickening of the aponeurosis is the inguinal ligament, which runs from the pubic tubercle to the anterior superior iliac spine. All the muscles of the anterior, lateral, and posterior abdominal walls insert to the same degree into the, the iliac crest, inguinal ligament, and pubic bone. And finally, we have the gluteal muscles. Uh, the gluteal muscle arises from the external surface of the iliac bone and the iliac crest and inserts into the upper femur. The largest one is the gluteus maximus, is the largest, most superficial, and the most posterior gluteal muscle, covering the posterior part of the ilium and the sacroiliac joints. Gluteus medius and minimus are more anteriorly placed, gluteus minimum, minimus being the smallest and the most deeply placed. <clears throat> Here we can see the piriformis muscle and the gluteus minimus muscle, and the obturator internus muscle, and the other small muscle of the, which attach to the upper femur. <clears throat> uh, by plane x-ray, the bony landmarks may be identified on the plane radiograph. The sacral promontory and the superior part of the pubic bone define the pelvic inlet, and the iliopectineal line running between separates the true pelvis from the false pelvis above. The sacroiliac joints are not optimally seen on the frontal view owing to their obliquity. Special views may be performed so that the X-ray beam passes through the joint to demonstrate it clearly. Uh, this picture shows the pulse and the true pelvis. This is the false pelvis and its content. Uh, it's the superior portion of the renal bladder when full, lower intestine, uterus, ovaries, and fallopian tube in the females. Regarding the true pelvis, the content of it is the rectum, urinary bladder, and in the female, the vagina and cervix, or in the male, the prostate. Differences between the male and female bone pelvis. The muscle attachments are more prominent in males. The pelvic inlet is heart shaped in the male and oval in the female. The angle between the inferior pubic rami is narrow in the male and wide in the female. Uh, this is compared between the female and male pelvis. Here we can see the heart shaped inlet, and here oval. Here the angle is more than 90 degrees. Here is less. And the concavity also. And all uh, these differences, because the female. And its function in childbearing in the female because of childbearing in the box. And this is also the shape of inlet in male and female. 
and also the angle more than 90 in female. The sacroiliac joint in X-ray, uh, normal diameter between two to four millimeter. If the joint space is widened, we think of pelvic fracture. Movement allows small rotatory movement up to two to four millimeter, not more. <clears throat> the function, uh, this joint transfer weight and forces between upper body and legs and the uh, other function is to shock absorber for the spine. This is the normal intact sacroiliac joint and this is widened sacroiliac joint due to this, this is the structure of the pelvis. The pelvic floor. The pelvic, the pelvic floor, uh, a sling of muscles closes the floor of the pelvis. The urethra and rectum and the vagina and the female pierce the pelvic floor. The floor is composed of two muscular layers, the elevator ani and coccygeus complex and the perineum. The elevator ani muscle is the principal support of the pelvic floor. It provides muscular support for pelvic organs and reinforces the urethral and rectal sphincters. The components of the elevator ani are named according to their attachment. Pubococcygeus is the main part of the elevator ani. It arises from the inner surface of the body of pubis and tendinous arch running posteriorly to the sacrum and coccyx. Pubo rectalis is the thickest, most medial aspect of the muscular sling, arising from inner surface of the pubic bone and forming a sling behind the anorectal junction. And finally, iliococcygeus is the posterior part of the muscle and runs from the posterior tendinous arch and the ischial spine. Here we can see the, the compartment of the pubo coccygeus and pubo rectalis. The coccygeus muscle is in the same tissue plane as levator ani. It arises from the ischial spine and sacrotuberous ligament and insert into the side of the coccyx and lower sacrum. It aids levator ani in supporting the pelvic organs. The perineum is the diamond shaped space between the pubis, the ischial fibrosities, and the coccyx. It is divided into two compartments by the transverse perineal muscles, which arise from the ischial fibrosity and run medially to insert into the perineal body. The anterior compartment is the anterior urogenital triangle, and the posterior compartment is the anal triangle. It contains the anus and its sphincters with the ischio-rectal fossa on either side. This is the triangles of the perineum. Anteriorly, we have the urogenital triangle and posteriorly the anal triangle and divided by the plane between the ischial fibrosities. Now we have uh, important uh, location in the pelvis, which is the ischial, ischial rectal fossa. The ischial rectal fossa is the space below and lateral to the posterior part of levator ani and medial to the inner wall of the pelvis. It's bounded posteriorly by sacrotuberous ligament and the gluteus maximus muscle, laterally by the fascia of the obturator internus muscle and anteriorly by the perineal body. It contains mainly fat. لكن إذا صار أكو باثولوجي it's important in the pathological condition of the rectum ممكن راح يشوف شيء غير الفات ممكن يكون بها هذه هي ال ال إسكيور إفضل فوسة هذا مكانها من هالجهة ومن هالجهة والcontents ما كان مثل ما نشوف أغلبها هو فات فإذا صار بها شيء ممكن غير الفات ممكن يكون هذا الحين لأن على باثولوجي بالرقم وهذه هم هنا so a CT scan Show the site of the ischiorectal fossa. Right under. Now uh, we have the radiology of the pelvic floor. Uh, imaging of the pelvic floor is mostly required for women with excessive pelvic floor laxity, leading to problems with urinary and bowel continence and rectal evacuation. Dynamic <coughs> rotography, which is indirect imaging of the rectal floor. It's possible with defecating protograph when the rectum, bladder, and vagina are outlined with contrast and the subject is imaged in the lateral plane. 
images are obtained at rest during a squeezing up maneuver to elevate the pelvic floor and during straining evacuation to evaluate pelvic floor movement and dynamics of rectal evacuation. And magnetic resonance imaging of the pelvic floor. The muscle of the pelvic floor can be directly imaged by MRI. And the pelvic floor movement also can be assessed dynamically with the MRI. Uh, now we have the quiz. يلا خلينا نشوف عفوا استاذ ممكن السؤال قبل هذا ام زحمه تفضل السلايد مال الساكو ايليك جوينت ذكر الدكتور احمد انه لما نسوي وايدنج بالساكو ايليك جوينت وي ويل ثينك اباوت بيلفيك فراكشر يعني بالضبط وات بيلفيك فراكشر دكتور ممكن نشك لي اني بيلفيك فراكشر اي طبعا هو عاده هو البيلفيك فراكشرز يصحوا له رينج فراكشرز يعني عاده الرينج فراكشرز تاخذ تو سايت فراكشرز يعني واحده مثلا اون ذا ليفت واحده اون ذا رايت فعاده يصير وياها وايدنينج دايستيسيس بالساكرو ايليك جوينتس فالمهم انت من يشوف وايدنينج زين هي مو بس هاي سمتايمز حتى إذا فديت ليجنز انفولفينج ميتاستاسيز او فتشيل هذه بس عادة ذيك مو مو تصير كومبليت وايدنينج يعني فوكال وايدنينج اما يعني سام تايمز اذا ميتاستاسيز او فتشيل بالبون وليتك ليجن هم يعني يصير وايدنينج بس انت وانس يو سي وايدنينج ان ون ساكرو ايليك جوينت يو هاف تو لوك فور فراكشرز ان ذا بيلفيس نعم استاذ واي تايب هاي اوبن بوك فراكشرز او غيره هواي يعني ان شاء الله اوكي اوكي اذا هسه نروح على الكويز نختار ساره عباس نعم استاذ ام ار اي اوكي ام ار اي تي 1 A is the ischium, right? Ischium. A right ischium. Okay. Adn Abu Bakr, موفق. نعم استاذ. ال ال B right obturator internus muscle. Obturator internus. Okay. إيلاف جابري سي زاهد نعم دكتور السي زاهد شنو هذا؟ سنفيزي بيوكس سنفيزي بيوكس اكسلين دي تبين نعم استاذ رايت ريكتس تيموريس مصر رايت ريكتس اوكي عندنا حسين عبد الكريم طاهر الاي عفوا استاذ بس تطلع الصوره شو صار عندي تاخر اوكي ربع الاسلام نعم استاذ نعم استاذ طلعت الو نعم يلا احكي انت دكتور نعم استاذ دي لا اي اي استاذ هاي رايت رايت سياتيك نيرف راي سياتيك راي سياتيك نيرف اوكي ايمان فلاح نعم استاذ الاف بقى لنا رايت اليوساس مصر زين اخير واحد دكتور عزام جي نعم استاذ جي رايت سارتوريوس مصر رايت سارتوريوس مصر بعد كل اف الاتش 
عندنا زهراء عبد الحسين اي نعم استاذ البكتينياس مصل الرايت بكتينياس مصل رايت بكتينياس مصل هذا فاضل يلا استاذ استاذ محمد اي استاذ رعد وياك هسه هذا من رقم واحد نبدي رقم واحد هذا السهم هسه راح يطلع ما عيني؟ على السهم العفو هو الكود على السهم هذا اشاره على السهم هدى رقم سته مو رقم سته هدى شنو؟ هدى نعم رعد نعم استاذ ليفت ساكرو اليك جوينت ليفت ساكرو اليك جوينت اللي بعده مروان يا هو اللي بعده رقم 21 استاذ سوبيرير بيوبك ريموس رايت سوبيرير بيوبك ريموس كل زين ليفت مو رايت الليفت استاذ نعم الليفت محمد خضير رقم 12 تمام استاذ استاذ هاي انتيرير انتيرير سكيل سباين انتيرير رايت انتيرير انتيرير سكيل سباين زين على نايف يا يا رقم وراها محمد ماجد اي استاذ هذه هسه رقم 10 استاذ الياك كريست رايس الياك كريست هذه اخر شيء زينة عبد الجبار نيكست شنو الكوكسيك رقم تسعة كوكسيك زين هذا هو استاذ 